Part three. Sleepy? Nah, getting there. Hmm. Junie's Winter Wonderland. <laughs> Junie was about to shut off a machine when... Hmm, reference to a Niflis level. Uh, it is a direct reference to the machine. Nice. What a curious glow. That denotes save points, I assume. Gonna need the umbrella for that. You're not around from around here, huh? This is Snowlandvania. Hmm. Really? This is kind of messed up, but hey, I'll take it. Water is so cold here, eh? Notice, a double jump power-up is required to move me on this point. Well, we started with it, so... Huh? East, Snowsville. <laughs> hey, we haven't seen you in town. Are you new? Yeah, kinda. Uh, I still gotta shovel a sidewalk. Recess ends in 30 minutes, huh? Kitties! I wish I was in bed too, dude. <laughs> I don't know what to do with myself now. <laughs> Try going east past the tundra. And we use a boat as a stepping stone and... Ooh, careful. Be careful? Yes. <laughs> Not that much lives on the other side. Yeah, I imagine. So we started out at the very end of the machine and got uh, sucker punched by a sudden uh, pitfall, essentially. Yeah. We are now leaving Snowlandvania. Come back soon. That was quick. Yeah. Man, that's practically not even worth keeping. Mm. Jumping in the rain. Hump McSlow. Cool. This isn't actually an environmental level, this is more of a playground level, because environmental levels tend to have a wind tile, normally. Playground levels have no objective, no end, you just screw around in them. Cool. That is like a save point on almost every other island. Because you are over water and it is very easy to die. Oh, there it is. It's down there. I can't access it from this side. Yeah, it's a very quiet episode. What? Speaking of... Oh, okay. There we go. Hmm. Coral formations. Oh, I almost took a dip. Again. <laughs> Nothing up there. At least it's not the void. Yeah, speaking of the void in Minecraft, now it's a black morass of death and doom. Ugh. Anyway, we gotta keep going. Keep and going. 1.9's coming out soon. Yeah, Notch is churning it out like he did back in the early stages of the beta. Back before yeah. you or I showed up. Yep. And now we're in the swamp They've section. got a really creepy record now. Oh, really? Yeah, it sounds like a Blair Witch Project uh, recording. Didn't 13 sound like that? Oh, this one's worse. Wow. Yeah, the Yogg's cast. There's something doing about this crap. island. Hmm. Really? I'm wondering. No. I don't think there's an. I Strange. I almost feel like I want to go home. Well, let's go home. Because beyond there is the void. Oh, 
<laughs> Man, it's quiet. I'm not yeah. liking. I'm not liking the lack of music. Yeah. I'm really not liking the lack of music. This is just creating a sense of deadness. Just a little. Swig. It makes you want to be very silent just in case, too. Oh, father. <laughs> Alright, here we go. This is about where we started at, isn't it? Yeah, it's the island we started on. Oh! Floodwaters. These islands are flooding now. <laughs> oh, hey! The rain is gone. I can see clearly now the rain is gone. I should shut up because I can't sing <laughs> worth a crap. <laughs> Actually, when I'm in the mood, I can do it well. But to be frank, I'm not very fond of singing. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, people! Welcome home, Junie! Yes, we are home. Yay! We are back in the communal island. Where's the save point in this map, anyway? Where is it? Where are you? Oh, there it is. We'll just Way use, down there. We'll just use that. And... Well. Well, that is the end of that level. So, uh -huh. Junie heads home. Tell me about the islands, Junie. Well, hello. Good to see you back. Did you travel far? Did you see much? Indeed, we did. Rain, rain, and more rain. Hi there. I hope you have a lot to tell us. Indeed, she does. <laughs> and that's about where I would probably put a wind tile if I was uh, making this level. No. Yeah. And here's Humph McSlow's other environmental level, Remembering the City. He actually went into a lot of commentary on the Niflis forum about this particular level. Ooh. Virtually everything in this level is very bizarre and ephemeral. It is said that the city used to be there all the time. It covered the world. That was a long time ago. Now the city only comes out at night. Some say it's a ghost of sorts. I think it's a memory. I think at night, the world remembers the city. It's daytime right now. We have ruins that the Nits live in. Going to the city again tonight, Junie? went down there myself once in daylight. Just a bunch of overgrown boulders. <laughs> yeah, it's just a conversation bit there. I really don't understand what you see in that place, Junie. Yeah, this is very lonely. Now it's dusk. Actually, let's turn back the clock a little bit, because there's something to see here. Mm. I 
built this little village for my friends. But At least they use it. Unfortunately, they don't have hands, so they can't open the doors. Then don't build the doors, silly. Uh. Anyway, moving back. Back on track. What the hell? Couldn't double jump for a second there. That was strange. Okay. Now it is nightfall. Pretty, pretty, pretty. We're gonna have a look down here first. Quiet. Very. Ah. The for the chirping. Oh, look at that. That's cool. What is this? Some kind of bizarre monument. Let's have a look. That was a pointless respawn. <laughs> <laughs> At least it doesn't say anything. It doesn't count them like I want to be the guy does. This is a strange monument. Anyway, here we are. This is what it looks like under normal conditions at daylight, just a bunch of boulders. But, as we move further in, lights. Lights in the trees. Mysterious lights where there should be nothing. The city is returning. Now you can see silhouettes of the buildings. Uh huh. Becoming more distinct. Phantom street lights, I assume. This is a very bizarre, ephemeral area. Completely illusory. <laughs> Now we're moving on to something that's a little more tangible. This is really here. What is its purpose? Juni does not know. I don't know if this cave is like this city. Creepy hieroglyphic looking egg thing. Uh, yeah. Well, we shall leave Junie here to contemplate this mystery. How you doing, Katie? Huh? How you doing? I'm alright. Mm -hmm. Let's see. A Walk at Night by Quinson Cartographer. This is actually a very early environmental level. Hmm. One night, Junie is up in the late hours of the night and unable to sleep. Compelled by the view from her window, she, she decides to go for a stroll. Roof is off limits. And we cannot climb, so yes, it is off limits. <laughs> Everyone else has locked their rooms for the night. So, on we go. A night in the city. Stupid move on my part. Drop off ahead. 
Now, in order to complete the level later on, we will need to acquire at least wall climb or high jump. And there's wall climb. It's very early. Why not sit and relax for a while? Love to, but <laughs> that's not an option. Well. So, in the meantime, we shall investigate the city. How'd the car get down here? <laughs> no idea. And the dinosaur. The hell is that? Whoa, water. It's death water. Nothing over there. Alright. Ah, high jump. In the hands of an idol of some sort. I had to investigate there. I'm sorry about that, Beers. <laughs> it's been a while since Curiosity. I've, it's been a while since I've played. So, uh. Yeah, I'm gonna investigate. Anyway, we now have high jump. See, that jump isn't as evil as that other one from the earlier level. Yeah. Below you is a sacred place. Indeed. Lots of statues running around down there. Or sitting around down there, I should say. <laughs> running? What? What are they? It's not made at the museum. Or that one Doctor Who episode. Oh, the creepy angel statue? Yes. Oh, look at that. We've walked all the way around the city. That was the apartment complex. That was quick. Satisfied with her explorations, Juni returns to bed and sleeps a deep, dreamless sleep. Good night, Juni. Okay. One more for the road, I think. Okay. In the dark. Where is Junie? She's supposed to be on Oh, jeez, that's quick. Yeah. Basically, what's being done in there is it's being done with auto shifts. So, if you want to read the dialogue there, you'll have to pause the video. Um... Yeah. You're normally only given, like, rudimentary, uh, you're not even given any power-ups, but to, uh, make the level a little easier, I added some stuff in. Haha, <laughs> see? Void. So... Bad void. Yeah, I don't even know why that block is climbable, actually. Maybe it was a mistake. That would be my guess. Anyway, so, Junie is in the dark, at night, making her way home. You know, I probably could have just simply removed long jump and double jump from this. she makes it home. Alright, that is the end of the first environmental montage. I actually have a large amount of levels that I have not tested yet. They're sitting in my Net Stories folder right now and they have not been done. Among them is my newest edition, Gaia, uh, Gaia 1.6. I'm going to 
snoop around in there for a little bit and see what new continents have been added to the uh, level, and we'll go from there. Yep. I'll let you know when it's time to do that one, Glide. For now, Alrighty. that's the cat. I'm the Watcher, and we will both see you in the near future.